Charles and Queen Letizia of Spain greeted one another like dear friends. On Tuesday, the future King of England and current Queen of Spain met at Auckland Castle in Bishop Auckland, County Durham, to see the new Spanish art exhibition by Francisco de Zuberan. Charles greeted the monarch by cordially clasping her hand. He then kissed the back of her hand and both cheeks. Queen Letizia made an elegant appearance at the castle as she wore a raspberry red dress covered with a black A-line coat and paired by her ensemble with matching red court heels and a quilted purse. Prince Charles looked smart alongside the Spanish royal in a lightly grey suit with a burgundy tie and a matching pocket square, completing his tailored look with dark brown lace-up brogues. The pair were scheduled during their visit to launch the exhibition. Zubaran, the Twelve Tribes of Israel, Jacob and His Sons, which was being held at the Spanish gallery inside the venue. The gallery at the castle, which forms part of a remarkable regeneration programme, is where the biggest collection of Spanish art inherited from the Golden Age is housed in the UK, making it a great place for the new exhibition. Earlier in the day, Charles was in great spirits as he chatted to farmers on a visit to Darlington to officially open an auction mart. Charles looked relaxed as he joked and laughed with local farmers in the quaint cafe with a group of people who enjoyed tea and cakes at Dot's Cafe in County Durham. Auckland Castle is one of Europe's best-preserved bishops' palaces, which is at the centre of an ambitious project funded by a city philanthropist. Founded by Jonathan Ruffer and his wife Jane, the Auckland Project set out to bring tourism to Bishop Auckland by using art, faith and heritage. It comprises a collection of galleries, gardens, parks and the spectacular Chiron historical reenactment shows, which are staged during the summer. Once home to the powerful Prince Bishops of Durham, the 900-year-old Auckland Castle has recently reopened after undergoing major conservation work, which has transformed its staterooms back to their original Georgian Gothic splendour. It is home to the 13 life-size figures painted by Francisco de Zerberan, which were originally brought by Bishop Trevor in 1756 and have hung in the long dining room ever since. In 2010, the paintings were in danger of being auctioned off by the Church of England Commission. However, philanthropist Jonathan Ruffer acquired both the paintings and the castle in 2012, preserving them on behalf of the nation and putting the work on display to the public. Queen Letizia was already in the UK as she was one of the many members of European royalty who attended the service of Thanksgiving in honour of Prince Philip at Westminster Abbey last week. She joined Queen Elizabeth and other family members, including Princess Anne and Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, in wearing an outfit entirely in the shade of Edinburgh Green, in memory of the late Duke of Edinburgh. That particular green was the colour of Prince Philip's official livery and was used for a wide array of things related to him, such as staff uniforms, private cars and even the Land Rover that was used to carry his coffin at his funeral last year.